Well, we can clearly see this is where that car ended up after it came crashing through the front of this store. The front door in pretty bad shape at this point. We're stepping through piles of shattered glass here. And the owner tells me the scariest part about all of this is that there actually were some customers in the store when this happened. We're part of a vehicle into a building. We're going to have a 73 year old female who's conscious and breathing. She is in the I'm standing right down in here in the parking lot. Chester Lawrence happened to be in Claremont just grabbing lunch Sunday afternoon when he saw the aftermath of that call to responders. An oh my god moment for sure. Everybody that was out here was like oh my god. Firefighters say a woman drove her car into the front of an American mattress store and despite the damage no one was hurt. Even little cars can make big damage like this. I noticed a handicap thing in the window when the tow truck was falling away and and I was kind of concerned. Justin says he and a few others watched as crews from Claremont and from Lempster came to her rescue. So we're get, getting her out, getting her to the hospital. I was a number one concern. And then they were all here working together, the team cleaning it up a little bit. Even the tow company that came, the guy helped out a little bit. And he says from what he saw, the crash just looked like a really unfortunate accident. It's sad in general because the mattress place is closing. You know, we've lost other stores, but yeah. this is just, you know, it was an oh my god moment for sure. And so we're already seeing some repairs underway, but the owner tells me he's not exactly sure how long it's going to take to get things back to normal. He's just thankful nobody was hurt from this. In Claremont tonight, Imani Fleming, WMUR News 9.